secrecy is something like forbidden fruit. You can't have it. It's classified. That makes you want it more. If somebody discloses that we listen to a cell phone that Osama bin Laden is using to talk to his Zawahiri, who's in Peshawar, Pakistan, this fact would do damage to the national security, so it has to be kept classified. The conclusion of the congressional inquiry in 9-11 said, we were fighting the war on terror as a country without our most powerful weapon, which was an alert and informed American public. The secrecy prevents the alert. The secrecy prevents informed action. The secrecy prevents democratic deliberation. The secrecy prevents effective counterterrorism. To fight terrorism, we need to know. Like the passengers on Flight 93, we need to know. Should Americans be involved in operations that kidnap foreign people, and should they make them disappear? And is that consistent with who we are as a nation? I would argue that that is exactly the kind of thing that we would want our intelligence services to be doing, because what we want is to wage that clandestine war, take it under the radar, so our enemy does not see us coming. And so we have more latitude of, of action. And we can use methods that are not necessarily consistent with the values of Americans. <laughs>